All right, what's going on, guys? So I just went to Target, and I have not been to Target in a very long time, and I completely sympathize with you women. I totally understand now why you spend as much money as you do when you go into a Target. I, I get it now. Like, I walked in there, it's been years since I set foot into a Target, and it's like, you know what? It's really upscale. Like, it is definitely one-upping Walmart by all means. And again, I could totally understand walking in there like I need one thing and I, I stopped and I'm like looking at all this other stuff like I I kind of want this. I don't need it. I don't think. I mean, that's that's the thought process of being a homeowner. It's like, well, what do I need all of a sudden? So all I wanted was this right here. This is an egg beater type of thing. I was hoping to get just this, just the beater attachment thing that I saw on the website for Target, but then I looked closer and it's like, well, it's online order only. And I'm like, Argh. point is, is I want this because the end, this little tip end here should, in theory, when I get home here in like two seconds, should fit into my DeWalt power drill. That's the whole reason why I bought this, was so that I could only use the beater part on my DeWalt power drill. Because when I attempted to cook Thanksgiving at my house, my mom brought over her electric mixer, and it worked just fine, but it's a corded, so you have to plug it in, and I'm not really offended by that in the least bit. Just to get the cord out of the way, use a cordless power drill. I have a brand new DeWalt power drill that I barely use, and I believe I remember seeing this having been done already on the internet, so now I'm thinking to myself, well, boy, you know. Canceling. Sorry about that. I hit a button on my car that I shouldn't have, but um, yeah, I'm pretty sure this end right here, if you can see it or not, goes right into the little teeth, the little chuck on my power drill. So I will continue this update in a second. I am pulling into my house right now. All right, so I apologize for the mess here. I just got home now. So this is my DeWalt power drill that I have, one of three that I have. So this is the beater that I wanted. And, let's see if I can uh, open this up. And sure enough, it goes right in. Sorry about that. Let me put the battery on, so hold on a second. <coughs> hopefully, hopefully this battery is charged up Watch this. Yep. I knew it. I knew it was going to fuck. My friend Vinny. So I wanted to do this. I called up my friend Vinny and I asked him. I'm like, hey, do you have one of these just beater attachments? Can I just borrow it real quick? Because I wanted to make mashed potatoes yesterday. And he's like, um, first off, I'm not home right now. And second off, no, you can't just use my stuff for your experiments and it's like it's not an experiment i've i've seen this before online i'm just now finally remembering that this is a thing and i'd like to show it to the good people of youtube and beyond so they know what the f to do on the off chance that you don't want to have to hand crank it yourself you can just do that it's a little loose but um whoops I hope I didn't just break it. <laughs> that is too cool. You you got to admit, that's kind of cool. So, yeah, if you ever want to sc scramble your eggs, mashed potatoes, or whip up some frosting or something, um, mm, this is the thing. So, yeah. Now you all know. Now you all know that you can do this with a power drill. Wonder what else can be done. I don't know.